Chikara fans, I'm Lightning Mike Quackenbush, flying solo tonight, a lot like Stephen Page in The Vanity Project, and I took a little bit of a break from comparing and contrasting Ricky Gervais's David Brent and Stephen Carell's Michael Scott to bring you another installment of Chikara podcast a go Today, on CPAGG, we've got all kinds of goodness lined up for you, which you're going to see right now, as an incredible match between Virgil and Iron Mike Sharp that ends with a snapmare coming at you. Or a chop and a slap, but neither man going down. Another chop. Back with a chop. Forearm by the Stormer. Head oh. by, by Kingston. We have seen Kingston in this very building. Oh, oh my God! Stormer with a pair of headbutts. King on wobbly knees. Apologizing now, fans, for as much as I'm getting into this. I'm, I've never seen this sort of fight out of. Shane Storm, he's had... Oh, he caught him! Spin wheel kick! I'm not sure what King was going for, but it failed! Middle of the ring! Two! Ooh! Shane Storm had one of the hardest fought matches in Chikara history he's back in 2005 for the Young Lions Cup against Icarus. Yep. I think he's given it just as much in this match as he did then. Oh, look at the blood dripping from the mask of Shane and Storm! all that's on the line in this match is not the Young Lions Cup, but pride. Absolutely, setting the pace for the whole year. Oh, and he's fighting it. Blocked that, uh... Oh, didn't get all that, got him a little low there. Oh! Man, for that second time, look at the... That ball. might be the one! Ooh! Two and nine tenths, I don't know how King's kicking out. And again, I can't tell from our vantage point here if King has been busted open because he is covered no, in I actually blood. believe that Shane Storm's blood. I saw it dripping from his nose earlier. You know, it was a match that I think back on, 1996 in ECW, and again, I mentioned it only because it was, a. Uh, Shane Douglas versus Pitbull 2. Shane uh, Pitbull number two was so bloody yeah. that more as much of his blood was on Shane Douglas sure. as there was on Pitbull number two, and that's what we're yes. seeing here. Strangely ironic, Shane Douglas, one of Eddie Kingston's heroes, as a matter of fact. Now maybe look at that air and crash. Oh, oh those Lord kidneys! Uh, again, I can't even say what that'll do to you, but it'll take a little oh. out of you in the morning. Oh. And Shane Storm it's back to on his feet! His feet. Oh! And there's a second one. And Shane, Shane Storm, Storm is I on his feet! Know. Oh, he's back to his feet! Back fist to the future. Oh! The second one. Oh, it's like the one, two, three! Fans, our Ray de Bolidoris mini-tournament takes place this weekend in Hellertown and Philadelphia. You can get advanced tickets on our website up until Friday night. After that, you're going to have to get them at the door. Now, up next, we've got another clip. This is from the main event of Two Eyebrows Are Better Than One. It's Trio's Increíbles time, as you're going to see. Uh, some very mixed-up tag teams, including Claudio Castagnoli, Lince Dorado, Ophidian, taking on maybe the likes of yours truly, Amasis, and Tim Dunst coming your way in this very next clip. Have a look. Tim Dunst. He doesn't have it all the way in now. There you go. He's got him locked in. Tim Dunst. Stretching, reaching. Ooh. Big boot right to the jaw of Claudio by Mike Quackenbush. Claudio hangs on. Oh, both men up and over the top with that big clothesline. Tim Dunst, worse for wear. Ophidian going for that cl cobra clutch with the body scissors again, I'm sure. There it is, he leaps. Dunst fighting off the leg. Push them back, rolls through. Ophidian. Oh! The gator roll, he calls that one. Lindsay Dorado perched up. Big drop kick right to the chest. Sends him out. Amos is in there now. Jacks his jaw with his knee. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Leg drop. He Puts calls that NBA. Not quite sure why. Again, this must be strange for them, just as it is for us. Oh, call the action. Right on the back of his head. Oh, Quackenbush is there. Oh. Ooh. 
rocked him with that European uppercut. Nobody does it like Claudio. Out of the corner, Claudio, come on. For something. We've seen this before on a claw. Oh. What does he have in store? Oh no. Thought he was going to go for that rolling European uppercut he's done before. Could be that fall away slam that he's done from the top. Quackenbush fighting it. He sends Claudio crashing to the canvas. Oh, it's Big Dragon Oh! When they have traded matches. Fans, all through the month of May, you're going to find great deals on all things Chikara in our online store, including a deal we've got going on with our trading cards, where you can get a complete set, including two as-of-yet unreleased cards. Just go to ChikaraPro.com, click on the link for store, you're going to find great things like this shirt, as well as advanced tickets for our upcoming Anniversario events in Massachusetts and Connecticut. All that good stuff awaits you there. Drop by Wigglysworld.com, you can find out all the things that Wiggly's been involved with at SmartMarkVideo.com, things like our DVD library await you there. And of course, if you want to enlist in our official fan club, the only place to do it is at Chikarmi.com. Read up on all things Chikarmi over there. Be back here next Monday for another installment of the Go-Go. I'm Lightning Mike Quackenbush, and I'll see you at the matches. Adios.